Hi guys, welcome back. Um, today I'm going to be doing a MAC haul for you guys and I'm really excited to show you guys what I bought because what I got from MAC is actually from their new collection which is called Flamingo Park and I love all of the stuff that they came out with this collection. I mean everything is so beautiful, super pigmented and this is not going to be a huge MAC haul because MAC is expensive so I only bought four items and that's all I have to say and let's get into it I don't know what to start off with everything's so exciting so I guess I'll just start off with the lipsticks since I bought two of them and they're these ones right here this one is the Viva Glam Ariana Grande and this is Please Me and this one Please Me was part of their Flamingo Park collection but the lady told me that this lipstick is also a permanent collection. So the first one I'm going to show you guys is Please Me. I wish they would have done something cute with this packaging, but I mean, that's okay. The lipstick is cute though. So that is swatched on my hand. As you can see, it's very appropriate for spring. And I really love this shade. I usually don't gravitate towards these kind of colors, only because they tend to be a little bit lighter on me. But uh, you know what? With a dark lip liner... This can work. So yeah, that is Please Me once again. And next I'll be opening up the Viva Glam Ariana Grande lipstick. This one is slightly different only because it is a Viva Glam lipstick. Pretty sure you guys all know what the Viva Glam lipsticks look like. It's super, super dark. I wish she would have released this in the fall season because this lipstick is super appropriate for the fall season. And I'll swatch this for you guys as well. And look at that, it's so dark. I'm definitely going to try to wear this as much as I can before spring officially hits because once it's spring, I'm ditching the dark colors and I'm going ham with my pinks and oranges and purples. As you can tell, I'm ready for spring because my hair's purple. So yeah, that is the two lipsticks that I bought at MAC. The next thing I picked up was this powder blush, and it is from the same collection, Flamingo Park. And it's the blush that I'm actually wearing right now. Um, I wasn't going to try any of this stuff out before I filmed this haul, but I couldn't resist. So I just decided to wear it on my face today, and I just put it back in the box. And this blush is called This Could Be Fun. And that is what the shade looks like. It's super, super appropriate for spring. I'm so excited for spring. As you can tell, this is another cooler toned pink shade. Again, this is called This Could Be Fun. So the last item that I purchased and the one that I'm most excited for is a MAC eyeshadow palette. And it comes with nine shades. And these shades are super, super, super bright. And it's, again, from the Flamingo Park collection. So that is what the palette looks like. I'm so, 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 so excited for this palette and to film a Valentine's makeup look with this. I forgot to swatch the blush, so I'll do a swatch of that. That is the blush. And I'll do some swatches of my favorite shades in this palette. So the first one that I'm obviously going to swatch is this pink one. Because this is the reason why I got this palette. This shade is called Bird's Eyes View. This color is the reason why I wanted to get this palette in the first place because it's so perfect for Valentine's and spring. Pretty much all of these colors are perfect for spring. I haven't used this yet, but I'm already in love with it. Let me just swatch a few more colors for you guys. So I'm going to swatch this blue one right here. So this is the blue shade I just swatched, and this one is called Wonderfully Weird, or I think it's called that. Never mind, it's actually called Weirdly Wonderful, and it's just this blue color. And as you can tell, like, it's super pigmented. It's swatched beautifully. Let's do some of the lighter shades. I don't know if the lighter shades will work that well, but let's swatch them. So I'm going to swatch this one. So it's actually a lot more pigmented than what I thought it was going to be. And this one would be good to set your eye primer, and this shade is called Flounce. I mean, I could sit here all day and talk about these colors and swatch them all for you, but... This video would be way too long because I could just ramble on about it. <laughs> so I'll just insert a picture of all the swatches. So that's everything I bought for this MAC haul. It wasn't a lot of things because MAC is super expensive and I don't have a discount or anything. I mean, it wasn't a big, huge, gigantic haul, but it was enough for me and I'm super happy with all the things that I've purchased. I'm definitely going to be filming a Valentine's look with the Flamingo Park palette. So if you guys were interested in buying the palette, you can see how it works. Yeah, that's all I have to say. Please don't forget to subscribe and like this video 
if you guys want to see more MAC hauls or just more hauls in general. Yeah, I'll see you guys next week. Bye!